So you might be having an issue where for some reason your specific, you know, Apple Watch is telling you that you have attempted too many times of the passcode and you have to wait now and you probably forgot your passcode of your, you know, specific Apple Watch. Now, this can happen for a few different reasons. The first thing you're going to want to do is that you just want to go ahead and understand that within your Apple Watch, if you have forgotten the passcode, you basically will not be able to, you know, use this specific Apple Watch as a normal Apple Watch. So you will have to go ahead and make sure that within your watch itself, you remember the passcode. Because if you don't remember the passcode, if there's no way you can find it, well then you're going to have to reset your Apple Watch. So to do this, what you're going to want to do is you want to go ahead and if for some reason you don't remember the passcode, you want to make your way over to your iPhone. So go inside of your iPhone and you want to basically find your watch application. So the watch app is the one that you're probably primarily going to be using within your specific device. So go and find the watch application like this. And what we're going to want to do is we're going to reset this Apple Watch. So we're going to want to get into our general settings inside of our watch application. And then what we're going to want to do is we basically want to scroll all the way down until we see reset. That little reset button right there. And then what we want to do is click reset. And we're going to see a few things right here. Now what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to erase our Apple Watch content and settings. Keep in mind, this is going to delete everything from our Apple Watch. So this is not a way to go ahead and basically go, go around that you know, passcode option. It is just going to go ahead and delete out everything from this Apple Watch basically. So if you don't even own the Apple Watch, if you don't own the iPhone associated with the Apple Watch, then it's not even going to work for you. So what you're going to want to do here is you want to go and click Erase All Content and Settings. This little panel is going to come up and you want to go and just double check, you know, just click Erase All Content and Settings again. And that is basically what you're going to want to do. At that point, your specific watch will then go ahead and basically reboot. And from there, you should be able to go ahead and hopefully recover your, you should be able to set up your Apple Watch as you normally would. You can set up a new passcode if you want to. And that's basically how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, so long.